wrist, just it like a stir fry. Whip it in the kitchen wrist. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, I'm Amanda. If you are a return subscriber, thank you, Mandas. Thank you for rocking with me because it's the Amanda, Amanda, Amanda show. You are in my kitchen today. We are meal prepping. This is also a request video from you guys. I get DMs. I get personal um, questions like text messages, calls from family and friends and ask me like, how do you meal prep? Like, where do you find the time? How is it simple? Like, is it hard? And I decided to go ahead and share a video with you guys. It's not hard at all. It's very time consuming. Um, even healthy, sometimes it could cause, but it depends what you get and how you just schedule everything, how you just plan accordingly. It's team healthy, okay, team healthy. I'm here to help you guys, keep y'all accountable, and y'all can go ahead and do it. Save y'all some time and money. This is something that you're interested in. Go ahead and continue watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, tell a friend. Don't be stingy, okay? Tell a friend if you know they're in a journey of eating healthy and trying to meal prep or want to meal prep, go ahead and share this video. If you're not following on IG, I don't know what you're doing. Like, just get with the program. We have fun. I'm a vibe. So go ahead and follow me on IG. I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. It definitely helped my channel. And we're gonna go ahead and get started with this video. First thing first, I'm gonna go ahead and remove the skin off the salmon. If you decide to keep it on, that's your preference. I know when it comes to bae, he do not like the skin. Actually, this is my first time, okay? My first attempt to take the skin off. Thank God for YouTube University, cause your girl, she did her thing. I did a great job. I see the technique, it's all in the wrist, it's all in the wrist. Running back from all the pain and violence. Big tools, now it's big tools, I'm kidding. Crying now from the Now I go ahead and clean my salmon with some lemon juice. I usually let it soak in between three to five minutes. Once that's done, I rinse it with some cold water. I mean this recipe for this salmon is busting oh my goodness Mwah. it is so good i got this recipe from brooke kennedy oh my goodness i don't know in the beginning why i started off with um lemon pepper and the lorries but that was an accident but it was still delicious Okay, so right here I got some pepper. Your girl was being lazy, but you could definitely get the big large pepper and cut it yourself. Here is the chicken breast from the night before that I cleaned and seasoned it. And this is the egg piece. Yes, so delicious. It is a Haitian seasoning that we call egg piece, the magic to our food.
here is the leftover the chicken breast i'm putting in the refrigerator i'm telling you guys this make your life so much easier go ahead get your meat clean it the day before and season it and voila these ribs have me on a choco oh my goodness so delicious these are the only ribs that i make for my husband i no longer eat red meat but i had to go ahead and put my whole family on because your girl don't know how to make ribs go ahead and check them out in your local grocery store i believe walmart have them and right here i'm just rinsing the sauce off because we usually use chipotle barbecue sauce I just love my mug. I brought it from Ross and they also have the man of strength. Okay, so first I had did like this. Then I did like this. And then I did like this. And then like this. And that got me this. You should really get these Tony ribs because they are delicious. Mm, too bad I no longer eat them no more. <laughs> Parsley on everything. Presentation is a must. Am I the only one? I know I can't be. I'm done rinsing off the sweet potato. Now you see me pat and dry with some paper towel. Taking out the aluminum foil because I'm going to go ahead and get some olive oil. Spray my sweet potato. Wrap it up. Poke some hoe and get ready for the oven. Okay, okay, I know y'all confused and like, Amanda, what the egg is going on? But trust me, guys, keep watching because your girl got y'all, okay? So actually, the water was boiling, but due to the video quality of the steam, I had to go ahead and adjust the temperature. But don't get it twisted, because the macaroni was definitely macaroni.
next is the vegetable i didn't have no time i was tired i was ready to get out this kitchen so go ahead and put it in the microwave however you choose The black beans, the corn, the rice pack. I mean, all of them going inside the microwave. I'm trying to make this simple and quick, okay? I'm trying to get out of this kitchen. Remember to work smart and not hard. I don't know how to make brown rice, and this is how I make my brown rice. We've stayed on the phone at night till dawn. Do you remember all the things we said? I love you so I'll never let you go. Do you Back with the eggs, I am removing the yolk. Don't need it. These are actually gonna be for some snacks, the egg whites. And here, I am making some quinoa for my brown rice because I'll be eating the brown rice and the white rice is actually for my husband. Now to our breakfast portion, I add about a scoop and a half of oatmeal. I usually prefer using water than milk. I drizzle some honey and some blueberry and that's my breakfast. This portion right here is our snack. I have apple, egg white, and orange. That was the reason why I removed the yolk because this is going to be um, part of the snack of the day. Yeah. 
moving along with the next snack it is trail mix you can never go wrong with that high on fibers and protein as you can see on the side i have slice of mangoes yes that is also part of the snacks make sure y'all pack and make food smart so y'all don't overeat go my plate for the week i have salmon the sweet potato mixed vegetables mm -mm -mm. which i saw earlier that was actually bay plate he had ribs the rice that's all of that already now moving along to my second plate of the day i have my brown rice my corn my black beans some chicken breast I did like a little Chipotle thing, but I'm so excited. I am finally done. Done, done, done. Very simple, go ahead, put your own twist to it, your own seasoning, your own day that you wanna do meal prep. I personally do my meal prep on the weekends, more so on a Sunday. So it's up to you, whatever works for you. If you are anything like me, going through a fitness journey to lose weight, to maintain the gains, and um, just want to be healthy, I suggest to go ahead and do a meal prep. It will keep you accountable. I mean, all that work that you put in the gym and you're not eating healthy, like, no, sis, no, no. You have to go ahead and put yourself on a plan, a meal prep, something, something so you can maintain those gains. you like, mm, I don't know. I don't know about eating the same food. I mean, you don't have to do the meal prep. Do whatever that works for you. And again, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment.